Hey guys, this is uh, Cypher117 from the place Minecraft, bringing you another world edit tutorial. And today we're going to be learning about how to generate cylinders and how to use a clipboard. Sorry. Right, first things first, we're going to add some towers onto the end of this wall, and we're going to do that using the cylinder generation. So you, you're going to want to stand in the center of your cylinder, which you want to make. So I've marked out that little square on the ground. Yes. Just so. make sure you're standing on that. Now to make a cylinder. Um, which is first things first is going to be the floor, so that's going to be slash slash. Oh, sorry. C Y L for a cylinder. Space. Oh, did I put no? C <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. Sill for C Y L. Space. Then the block type, which is going to be forty three, because that's double steps. And then we want the radius, and our radius is going to be three. And the radius. Important thing about that is it excludes the block you're standing on. So the so the radius is three, but you're standing on a central block. So from if you include the block you're standing on, the distance to the edge is four blocks. Mm -hmm. so, so that's it might be a little confusing, but once you get used to it, it'll make sense. Don't worry about it. So our radius is three, and yeah. then it's below us, so we want a minus. The space of it as well. Um, a space after the three. Yeah, and then you're gonna one because we want your floor to be one. Was that it? Yeah. Now click enter. And there we are, we have our floor. Um, right, now we're going to generate the base of our tower. Do I so, stand here? Yeah, stand yeah. in the center again. It's always directly around you. So, slash slash H. Wait a moment. What's it today? So, yeah, slash slash what? H. H for hollow. Yes. And then do C Y L again. So, hollow cylinder, H, sill. Now, yeah. space. And it's going to be 43 again. Space, our radius is going to be 3 again. And this time, um, we're going to want one. Is that it's, it? Yeah, just a positive one. And there we are. That's the base of our cylinder. And now we want to generate the actual tower part. Do you have to do it in these steps? Do you have to generate this like here before you can generate the tower part? Or can you oh, no. okay, just increase the height? Um, if we... uh, you made a good point there. Okay, you don't... You know what? Let's do it a different way then. So keep standing where you are, yeah. and we'll generate the walls first. So do slash slash H sill for hollow cylinder. The block type is one for smooth stone. So mm -hmm. space one, and then after the one, we're gonna have a radius for of three. And then How tall? Uh, let's make it five. Five. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, and there you are. So that's our basic cylinder. And now fly back inside it. Now we can put in the little fancy base bit. Okay. So that's what, right. that's the same as what we did before. Well, perfect time for the weather. Um, right. slash slash h so. Yes. Forty three space forty three. Then is it space three? And then one. One. And then that will do the. And there you are. And that's plonked your uh, little basin. Huh. That's pretty neat. Um. Oh, you know what? Here's a good time to use stack again. If you if you remember from our last tutorial, I remember I said stack was really useful, but I didn't really explain fully how useful stack was. So I'm just going to punch in some windows and uh, do this. I just thought I'd mention it. I'm a complete noob with cylinders. I've never used cylinders in my life. I've used some aspects of wallet edit, but cylinders I've never used. And if it's, if it's a bit too slow, sorry, I'm not... I'm kind of retarded, <laughs> but yeah. Okay, so now we can stack our tower to make it taller. So select, um, stand down here, and do uh, pause. just stand, and we'll do you'll do pause one. Slash slash pause. Now I don't know if one. you completely mentioned this in our video. One's important because that's your first position. Yep. So that's when you and must and remember. Um, you, we're using pause because that just uses the position of your feet. So, so now do I have to fly here? Uh, down a little, I think. And now. Yeah, try that. Now do slash slash pause. Is there any real way to know exactly where your feet are? Uh, no. There, there you are. Um, so now we're going to stack our tower up the way. So slash slash stack. Do I? Do I that and now we're going to, you want to stack it twice, I think. Two mm -hmm. and then U for up. That it? Yeah, now enter. Ta-da! Huh. Tower. That's, that's pretty neat. Okay. So now we are going to use 
our clipboard. Mm. We it's... could use copy and paste to put it over there. Yeah, so I mean the clipboard. Yeah, sweet. Okay. So select your entire tower again using pause. Could I do we could we could do expand here, couldn't we? Oh but yeah. Maybe okay. a pain in the um in the backside. <laughs> That'd be easy if we just done pause, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's up to. This is where you got really lots of options about how See, you do things in World of Oh, wait, why am I doing H pause? <laughs> That's hand. What is it, pause two? Pause two. There you are. Now go yep. down to the other side. Oh, you've already got it selected. Right, so now you're gonna sit yourself in the middle of the tower. Um, in fact, probably the easiest thing to do it fly down to the ground. Alright, stand right in the middle. And now you just do slash slash copy. Now copying is... It's confusing at first, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, <laughs> don't worry. But I'm going to explain he's it. He's going to explain it as best as he can. Now, are we okay. going to... Okay, so now you're going to fly over to your second one. And remember where that mark is? Now, because we, we copied it when we were in the center of the tower, that means when we paste it, it's gonna, we're going to be in the center of the tower again, so it's going to be pasting all around us. So, um, I am going to backtrack a bit, but just for now, we'll do slash slash paste. Okay, now just look around your tower, and you... So we basically pasted it right, but if you have a look, you'll see inside... Um, you'll see one of our windows is misaligned, if you go inside. Look down to the right, and the left. Oh yeah, hmm. there. But that's because um, the windows, the wall is on the other side now. Before the wall was on that side, and now it's on a different side. So what we're gonna do here is use the rotate command. So do so I want to undo? Um, you can undo for clarity. Yeah. Just to so slash slash see. undo, so you can see. So we're back to where we were. Oh, we got a bit of break. That, that's fine, doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, just man, this. So we're gonna do slash slash rotate. Oh, roll. <laughs> nice bound. Right, so uh, and then one eighty. We're just one hundred eighty degrees. Now, can and I now paste? we can paste it. And there you are. The window should be lined up properly this time. Um, maybe you should mention that. I mean, this it doesn't matter so much of this, but the way that you're facing is also important when you copy something. No, it's not. That's what confuses people. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm still a world at it, noob. Yeah, yeah, you are. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's not... The way you face is not important when you're copying. So, right, now we're going to learn how to use flip. And we got this little F shape uh, lined up here. So, do you want to select the F? There we are. I'm going to be quickly, because my... Be, I'm going to be quick, because my mommy wants me home for tea. Yay! Um, right, so now, stand <laughs> on this block and copy it. Can you remember how to copy? Of course. Absolute pro. I'd allow if I failed. I don't know. Very pro. Um, right, now let's move over to the next block. Over here. And so you're going to use the flip command. Now, you can just po point in the direction you want to flip it. Uh, easiest way to explain the flip command is just to do it. So, do slash slash flip. <laughs> clip. Flip. Yeah. Uh, now press enter. And it says clipboard. Now, just... now you do now paste. And you can see the F has flipped its orientation. Uh, and it flipped it in the direction he was facing, which was towards these arches. Uh, so that's that's basically how it works. Oh, and one last thing. Um, if you want to remove something completely, instead of copying it, you want to cut it out. Basically you just type slash slash cut. Or or you can replace it with air blocks. Oh yeah, so you, you can, can do double force or set zero. But if you cut it, that also it removes it, but then it adds it to your clipboard, so you can cut yeah. it from somewhere and paste it somewhere else. So there we are. And now we're gonna go for one final final thing. I'm not gonna go far away for this. Far I don't like the rain. It's sucks. Far away. How far? You suck. Because we're gonna Stop be generating new. We're gonna be generating new terrain. I know it's crazy. Oh look at that river. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's blow up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Where's so the fly best down point here. To yeah, right here. Fly down here. Actually, blow up the island because it'll look worse that way. Right here. Okay. Ah. Uh. Right now, uh, drop down to ground level, and you'll do slash, uh, slash, sphere, 
And now, come on, you got spe- spells for oh, your right. Oh! Oh, oh he's about <laughs> right. Uh, Is it the same do... thing? Do you do the same yeah. thing as you do for cylinder? Yeah. So you do the block type, then the radius. So it's going to be 46. Do I have to just do any radius? Yeah. yeah, just make it... Not not too big. Make it four. I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Enter. Oh. Uh, and see, now you're inside the sphere. Oh, yeah. I really went... So wait, is this through? <laughs> <laughs> Escape your sphere. Whoosh. Okay, there you go. Uh, so now we generated a sphere of TNT. Um, I'm flying away before you blow this up. I'm scared. Let's just. We need to self one. This, this is just a demonstration of what, how a griefer would do things. Oh, oh, I've frozen. Oh, I haven't. Ah, oh, dear. I've frozen. <laughs> <laughs> Does that freeze the oh, audio? I've unfrozen. No, you haven't on for oh no. Uh, I love how basically he's hosting the server on his laptop, so he's playing and hosting the server. Whereas all I'm doing is playing. And I'm recording. I'm recording. Okay, that wraps up. So that wraps up. Thanks for watching, guys. There'll be hopefully another one of these. Oh god, crazy lag. Hopefully there'll be more of these tutorials on the way. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. Generating thanks. spheres of TNT can get out of hand really quickly. Yeah, anyway. we've we frozen. <laughs> okay, thanks okay. guys. Have fun. Bye.